Chrissy Teigen opened up about cancel culture while leaving lunch with her mom Viley Luck, after she was accused of cyberbullying earlier this year. While in the passenger seat of a Porsche Taycan on Thursday, the 35-year-old cookbook author took a few minutes to chat about being boycotted by the world after her abusive messages resurfaced from 2011 resurfaced that showed her telling then-teenage Courtney Stoughton to take a dirt nap. When asked if she was out of the cancel club by a photographer, she replied she didn't know and that the past few months have been a journey. We have to forgive people, the mother of two stated in a video obtained by Daily Mail. Comma she exited the parking lot of Ebaldi in Beverly Hills. For the occasion, John Legend's wife rocked a light wash denim jacket, a white face mask and a black supreme baseball cap over her ponytail. She styled her look with a pair of black leggings, a matching sports bra, which showcased her toned midriff, Givenchy handbag and pink shoes. Her outing comes after recently reflecting on grieving her baby, Jack, after suffering a miscarriage halfway through her pregnancy last September. Five days ago, the star revealed she was feeling slightly down lately. It kind of started when I was thinking of my book caption and typed out my third baby is here, as in cookbook, then realized my third baby will never be here, she captioned a photo of her and legend. She continued, I realized I threw myself into the book to not think of the real, actual third baby. I don't really feel like I fully processed Jack and now that I don't have the alcohol to numb it away, things are just there, waiting to be acknowledged. I guess what I'm saying here is life is so f***ing complicated. Tegan got sober late last year after her 35th birthday because she was done with making an A of herself and tired of day drinking and feeling like ST by 6, not being able to sleep. In June, Tegan admitted she's been depressed and lost since taking a step back from public life after she was called out for cyberbullying people in years past. Five don't really know what to say here. Just feels so weird to pretend nothing happened in this online world but feel like utter ST in real life, the statement, which was under a first-person perspective snap taken from Tegan's living room. Going outside sucks and doesn't feel right, being at home alone with my mind makes my depressed head race. Chrissy was ready to admit her way wasn't helping much, saying, but I do know that however I'm handling this now isn't the right answer. I feel lost and need to find my place again, I need to snap out of this, I desperately wanna communicate with you guys instead of pretending everything is okay. She explained, adding, I'm not used to any other way exclamation mark the star went on to quit that cancel club was fascinating, but that she's learned a whole lot from the experience. Only a few understand it and it's impossible to know till you're in it, she went on. And it's hard to talk about it in that sense because obviously you sound whiny when you've clearly done something wrong. It just sucks. There is no winning. But there never is here anyhow. Pivoting to a more positive note, Chrissy told her fans, All I know is I love you guys, I miss you guys, and I just needed an honest moment with you because I'm just tired of being sick with myself all day. Wondering if sharing was wise, she went on, I don't even know if it's good to say any of this because it's gonna get brutally picked apart but I dunno. I can't do this silent SD anymore. Then, she reached out to anyone else who's been cancelled, writing, if you or someone you know has also been cancelled please let me know if there is a cancel club reunion because I could use some time off my couch. Before signing off with love and thanks, 